Hello guys, this is tutorial number one, the very original one, and this is for the FRC Scout app. And we're going to start out scouting a team in pit scouting, just like you would at a regional. So here's the pit scouting view, and then we are going to select record a team, because that's what we're going to do. And We're actually going to record Team Driven 1730 today. So now on this view, I'm going to type in the team number of 1730, which is our team, and then put in the team name of Team Driven up here in the top right corner, right in that text field. And then I'll go through and select all the different stats of this robot, like a six or eight wheel drivetrain. And then also for the shooter, I'll say it's a puncher. And then preferred goal, I'll say hi. They don't have a goalie arm, so I'm not going to put that there. Floor collector, yes. And autonomous, I'm going to say yes. And for autonomous starting position, I'll say left, middle, and right, because they're a pretty diverse robot. And then hot goal tracking, yes. Catching mechanism, they don't really have one. I mean, it can catch, but not really. Then bumper quality is pretty great. And for additional notes, uh, I'm just going to put in pretty quality robot. So uh, this just about sums it up for team driven. I will go ahead and snap a picture, but I would rather take it from my photo reel because I've already taken a picture. So I'm going to scroll through this and scroll up a bit. And hey, look, there's a team driven photo. So I'm going to use that photo. It looks pretty good to me. Uh, normally it'd be a robot picture, but just for tutorial's sake, I'll use Team Driven's logo. So I'll hit save. Looks all good to me. So now I'll go over and view this team. So go back to pit scouting page and then click view teams. Now I will select Team Driven. And if you'll notice there, I have all of the different stats that you just filled out. And if you want to make the robot picture larger or smaller, you can to see more detail. Now I'll hop back and we will actually match scout this team. So hop over to match scouting and sure enough you see a sign in view. So um, you enter your three initials, minor LBB, and then you type in the current match number. And notice how I also already selected red one and I typed in my team number. I am now hopping over to week three and selecting Greater Kansas City Regional. Okay, so now you'll notice that all the data that you just filled out and now appears on the screen. And I'm gonna type in the team number that I'm watching is Team Driven 1730. And notice the robot picture pops up just to help you out to spot the robot on the field. Now I will say that they scored a couple in the high, hot, and they also got a mobility bonus during autonomous. Now for teleop, I'll say they, make, they made a couple in the high goal. And also they missed one and then they made one more in the high goal. And for the, uh, they made one in the truss, made a couple in the truss actually. And then they got a few receives and they assisted several times throughout this match. I think that looks good to me. So I will hop over to add notes and then I will say they hung out in the white zone and the blue zone and then add some quick notes. So I'll say that they had some fast movement and they had some great ball pickup and uh, they had a pretty great human player along with great cooperation and a pretty great driver. So overall, I will say that it's a pretty well-performed match. So I'll type that in real quick. Well-performed match. And then hit save. So now it says, cool story, bro. And you just saved and looks all good it's stored in the database so now you can go over to single team on the data view and select the team and sure enough there's team driven the match that you scouted underneath the regional category you got all your averages on the top along with zone tendencies so you can see where they stayed in the different spots um, during their matches on average and um, over here on the data view, you can see the match that you scouted. So you have the autonomous category on the top and the teleop on the bottom. And you can also see your notes and the alliance that they were in that match and also the zones that they hung out in and also see who, re who recorded it on the bottom of that little view. And uh, you may notice all the different uh, values that you have put in uh, for each category. And you can also, if the notes are large enough, you can scroll through them. So that's it for the detail view. And also from this view, you can view the uh, pit scouted info once more. And again, the zoom in feature on the team driven picture on the robot picture also works. So then you can close out of that 
and go about your merry way. So thank you very much for this, for watching this, and I hope you guys have a great time with this app. Please give me some good feedback. Thank you.